Speedway. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. So look at the track. It's got all the all the race cars. I mean, I'm scared. I no one. Nobody. nobody gets the ride. This is gonna be so fun. because we were on the racetrack and the camera had to be put back in the room so I just ran to the room to get the camera and here it is sailing away from our balcony so that's the Port of Los Angeles we have a helicopter escort but look at this lighthouse how beautiful this lighthouse is So, goodbye, Port of Los Angeles. We'll be back tomorrow. So, I'm heading back up deck now to meet up with Jason. The racetrack was fun. We'll tell you more about that in a minute. Uh, the first time that this ship has ever cruised out of the port of Los Angeles so it's getting a lot of uh, TV coverage I guess helicopters are out with their cameras it's kind of a big deal pretty cool
next stop for us is the Galaxy Pavilion. You coming, Jace? We got, J we got Jason hooked up on Wi-Fi now. And we got, we were very lucky that as soon as we got on the ship, we went and we signed up for all the activities. So we got laser tag, we got the Speedway, and we got Galaxy Pavilion reservations. A lot of people did not. No. No. Oh yeah, Jason just made a good point. We've never cruised in the Pacific before. So look. Well, it's a window. Pacific Ocean. Yep, Pacific Ocean. So, like I was saying, we got, we've done laser tag, we've done the speedway, and now it's time for us to go to Galaxy Pavilion, which is the virtual reality. So, not everybody was able to get the reservations for this, so we lucked up on that. You coming, Tony? Yeah. That's gonna be cool. Okay, so Galaxy Pavilion is on deck 16, and you go behind the Aqua Park. So you go past the aft elevators, and here's the Galaxy Pavilion. So Galaxy Pavilion, Entourage, and the Video Arcade, this is the entrance for all three. Okay, so here is the Galaxy Pavilion. Tell you what, make a reservation or you're gonna have trouble getting in here. <laughs> We're following you around. Okay. Oh, cool. <laughs> okay, so this is the Indy car. Oh, wow. How stinking cool is that? Racetrack, Exterminator. Oh wow, yeah, walk the plank. Oh my gosh, flying. How cool. Oh, I wanna do this. Is that, is that the one you wanna do? It's like a roller coaster. So look, you can see on the screens there. That's what they're seeing. So we're gonna do this one next. Coaster. Bye. It's a finger coaster. I can't see us, but ha ha ha. Are you filming? Yeah. <laughs> okay. That was interesting. That sucked. That was like not even close to. Uh, that made me sick. How it made you sick? You want to do the racing? The cool thing about the Galaxy Pavilion, it's on the front of the ship, so you've got these amazing views off the front. So we're gonna do this next. We're waiting our turn. Can we go? Oh, okay. What do you do? Oh, okay. All right, let me show you. Also on this deck is the Entourage Teen Lounge. See, adult free zone. This is this 13 to 17 year old club. And then here is the arcade as well. And the arcade stretches all the way around. And then you go into Galaxy Pavilion. Hello. No, maybe you want to Maybe in there. This is the Entourage 13 to 17 year old club. This is it. This is tiny. This is the teen club. Okay. 
and outside of Entourage is the video arcade. These are all paper swipe games. Star Wars Battle Park. Tell you what, this is the coolest location I've ever seen for a, a arcade with a view like that. So this is all arcade through here. And then you leave the arcade and it's the Galaxy Pavilion. All right, so we're in line for the Flymax. That's the Flymax right here. Right here. So it's a simulated uh, glider. I got my safety mask. So Lisa's got her, they got a little mask, to, you know, because they got to put those. Um, for the goggles. Those goggles on, so. That cuts down on germs. So here goes Elisa. She's going to get on her Flymax. Suiting her up with the goggles. Okay, here she goes. She's taking off. Sorry about the glare. There's not much I can do about that. That's what she can see. It's like over a creek, riverbed. Off she goes. Off she goes. She's soaring. Look at Elisa soar. So we're doing the 3D show now. Seventy show is what I'm talking about. Oh, it's zombies. Oh. It's zombies. What's funner than blasting zombies? I know, right? You've reached the final stage of your training. I want you to have one last target practice before your first mission. We have guns. I guess you call it. Yeah, it's like 3D or 4D, 3D. You got the wind blowing at you. And uh, but your 3D, glasses are yeah. good hard frame glasses. They're not those cheap paper ones, you yeah. know. Yeah. So they're good glasses. You're you can shooting feel the like, zombies. You can feel like the fan, and yeah. you can feel like the elements, the wind, and the and rain. And your chair shake. Chair shake. That was, so fun. That was fun. That was, I think, the Fun best part day. of Galaxy Pavilion. Now we didn't do this race car here. That's the Indy car. Yeah, the no, Indy but car. The, but the because other the two, line's long. The other two uh, simulator rides are. Yeah, a, the, a lot of the virtual reality that we've done is just okay. Like the graphics aren't great. I've never ever been impressed with it. I know. Reality. It's just not. They try to make it real life, but it's not even close. Yeah, I mean this is a really I fun liked, experience. I like the race car game. Yeah, the race it car was a virtual fun. reality, but it was a good fun game. Yeah. Seats moved around, you could really feel the car, like yeah. you're really racing. I thought that was fun. Yeah. So anyway. Do you want to wait in line for the Indy car? Nah. Nah. This is cool. Okay. There's some coloring sheets over there you can add. Alright. Okay. You just take the one you made, put it under the scanner, and push the blue button, you can scan it, and now it should drop in somewhere in the middle of the screen. Give it a second. Alright, now 
There it goes. And it comes in and it looks like the one you saw. Oh, very cool. Okay, we have to do this. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna draw. You wanna do a shark or do you wanna do a whale? Or? I'm gonna do this whale here. Let's do okay, this. so what happens is. Let's do a shark here. So they have these, these trays with these pages and they have different designs. This one's a shark and you color them in with the crayons, okay? And then you take them over there to that little scanner. There's a little scanner, we'll show you. You push the scanner button and it scans it and then it'll drop your coloring right somewhere in the middle. And you'll see your, your drawing and your, or your coloring come to life in the fish tank here. Pretty cool. So Elisa's doing a shark. Voila! <laughs> EECC travels with a purple eye. Okay, so now let's right. take it over, scan it in, drop it in the tank. Oh my god. Hold on. Okay, so she's, she's got it here. We're gonna scan it. Is that what she said to do? Press the button? Press, press it right here. I did. There it goes. Scan it in. Okay, now, somewhere right around here, it's gonna drop it in. There it is. There it goes right there. Oh, it's backwards. Oh, it's backwards. She did it backwards. That's okay. There goes our fish. Okay, we scanned it upside down, so let's rescan it. Push. Why is it not working for me? Maybe turn around. All right, let's try it again. There it goes. Oh well. It'll flip around. Oh, there it goes. There goes our two little fishies. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, it's ski ball time. Oh, so close. Okay, my turn. Start. Jason's top score, 24,000. Here. You gotta, you gotta warm up. It need, you need yeah. like a, uh, you gotta get a couple of warm ups to dial in how you're gonna do it. Oh, got a 4,000 one there. 4,000. Uh, 21, that's not bad for my first go. No, okay, let's do it again. Thank you. Thank you. This one's ready. Oh, there you go. Okay, here she goes on her second run. See if she can beat 24,000. Huh? She's usually pretty good at ski ball. She's at 8,000 now. Let's see. 10. She's at 14. You beat me. She beat me by a thousand. Here, you try again. Thirty thousand. When nobody's watching, I can hit that four thousand over and over. I just saw this gigantic mountain out there off in the horizon. You see it? I mean, that thing is. The camera's not doing justice. That thing is gigantic. It's right out there in the middle. I assume nothing else around it. That thing is huge. Anyway, this is, uh, I love how on the Norwegian ships, they have these, they have these uh, sliding glass doors. You can open them. Sorry. Sorry. That 
noise that you heard the first time was you have to push this thing down and then slide it over otherwise it makes that noise but anyway look at this diner this is the speedway diner and this place is really gnarly themed out really cool look at all the tables here it's got all the license plates some here from california saw some from louisiana earlier wisconsin but it's really cool themed like an old school diner see the gas pumps and the, these are booths but they look like old school cars and uh really cool theming you got um look at this this is where their beverage uh bar is and this is their bar really cool vintage old school seating diner style um and this is uh this is this is what took the place of uh well, what do you call it uh, margaritaville where this is is where margaritaville was on the breakaway so i gotta say i think i like this better now you know i love me some margaritaville but on the breakaway it wasn't that happening i think this has got a little better vibe to it so we were hoping to come up here and get something to eat but it's yeah, closed this is weird it is 6 30 and there is hardly anybody out here and we're the only ones at the bar hi Kara. Hello. and we're the only ones at the bar the only ones here slides aren't, aren't running no i wonder i bet tomorrow morning we could get on the slides because it'll be warmer because we'll be in mexico she wants me to do the slides so we just noticed that we've got another ship sailing right next to us so it's a it's one of the small carnival ships it's either the imagination or the inspiration of course i can't tell from here but look at this can you see it let me zoom in it's cool having uh ship traffic with you So I'll have to look up the itineraries to see if that is the imagination or the inspiration. But those are the, the smaller, older ships. But we have company, which is cool. But man, look at that. That is why we cruise for that view right there. So it's really cool outside, like cold cool. So we're sailing in the Pacific. We've never sailed in the Pacific before. I think that's why there's nobody outside. It's so cold. <laughs> I'm not cold. I'm loving it. But look. No people. See? Empty bar. Alright, so went to the buffet and got a hamburger, fries, potato salad, and pizza. And Jason, what all did you get? I got some uh, prime rib and I got some uh, um, halibut tiki from the Indian and I got some barbecue chicken drumlets and a hamburger and hot dog patty. All That's meat. a whole lot of meat. Mm. <laughs> so this is at the front of Garden Cafe. You've got the seating with the views off the front of the ship. And then see one deck below us is the observation lounge. <laughs> That's where I want to go. Yeah. But honestly, you've got the same view from right here. Not really. That place looks chill down there. We need to get over there. Yeah, we'll go down there. It's great time. Hello. Yes, please. I would like, um, is that cherry? Yeah. Yes, cherry. Chocolate too. Some vanilla sauce. 
Thank you. Mm. Ooh, whipped cream. I almost forgot. Must have a dollop of whipped cream. What did you get? I got a, I'm cheating a little bit because we have one day on this ship. So I'm just like, you know what? I'm going to eat bread and butter pudding. And I ladled some of the vanilla sauce over it. Not my favorite, but it's good. Got good flavor. Apple cobbler, my go to. Mm. That's on point. That's delicious. Oh. Want to bite? Look at that apple cobbler. And then I have a chocolate and cherry grape. Wow, that thing looks different. Yeah, she made it really big. That's a colorful looking crepe there. And you gotta get you a, a bite of that cream with it, right? Yes. Okay, so mm, inside. Okay, so bite of the cream, bite of the crepe. Oops. Oh, she lost it. Mmm. It's hitting. Firing on all. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> Oh, that's so good. I'm about to get me one. That is so stinking good. If I'm cheating, I'm cheating hard. That's right. Bingo. All right, Look so this at is, that this is what plate. happens when Jason has a blowout. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, you are witnessing firsthand a breakdown. This is what a breakdown looks like, a diet breakdown. You know? I'll just fall right off the wagon. You know what? I don't even fall off the wagon. I just burn the damn thing down. You're so funny. Mm. A second helping of the apple cobbler. It is so good. Mm -hmm. Jason got him a crepe. I'm getting and a fix. And two cupcakes. <clears throat> I'm going to get my fix. Mm -hmm. one, one night only, I'm going to do it big. Yep. Go back to the diet tomorrow. Yep. Keep on trucking. But I'm going to enjoy tonight. That op apple cobbler is delicious. And he got two helpings of it, so. Well, I love, love good old apple cobbler. <clears throat> I want to see you try that crepe. Oh, those crepes are to die for. Apparently, I was needing something sweet. Yeah, apparently. I know. I just got the cherry with the cream. better with the Nutella. Yeah, I said, I said, can I get a uh, cherry? And she said, just cherry? I said, yeah. <laughs> Apparently a lot of people get something else. Yeah. Well, the cherry and the chocolate goes really good together. That's what I had. <clears throat> I like it. Mm -hmm. These crepes are amazing. Good. Chocolate cake. Okay. I'll be going into a diabetic coma shortly. <laughs> You're not a huge cupcake person, so. <laughs> the challenge is getting your mouth all the way around it. I like that one better. Yeah. I think I'm gonna eat the whole thing. <laughs> You're hilarious. <laughs> You're witnessing a total breakdown. I love it. You have to do this every now and then. I'll go about my merry way tomorrow, but mm -hmm. I get one night on this cruise ship. The Norwegian has good food. Really good food. Oh, I'm going to take advantage of it. And your body's 
needs a calorie blast every now and then. Mm-hmm. Might as well get good cruise food, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So we are in the theater to see Footloose. This is something we have so been looking forward to. 